Hello and welcome to Red Star Blur channel. This is the third video in our 3JS tutorial series. In this video, we are going to talk about geometry and walk through the common geometry types in 3JS. Let's check it out. So geometry is the structure of every model in 3JS. You can think of it like skeleton of the model that you created. Usually, we would create a 3D model externally such as using Blender or 3ds Max and then import it to 3JS. But still, there are lots of basic built-in geometry that you can create it in 3JS. So if you look at 3JS document, you will see that there are two types of geometry, regular and buffer. Basically, they are the same, except that the buffer geometry internal coding structure was designed and optimized to reduce the cost of passing the data to the GPU, so it has better performance. But the catch is that you cannot access to the vertex or some attributes directly. For example, I can display all vertices of this shape to the console for regular geometry. but I'll get undefined instead for the buffer version. For this tutorial, I'm going to use regular geometry for the simplicity. Now let's walk through some basic geometries. So let's start with box geometry. Obviously, it is used for creating a cube or any quadrangle shape. The constructor argument requires width, height, and depth. And there's a plane geometry, which is a 2D version of box geometry. Now when working with plane or any 2D geometry, it should be known that only one side of the plane geometry is visible, unless you have specified the double side attribute of the material like this. And next is the sphere geometry. The interesting note of geometry with rounding shape is that you have to specify the number of segments to the constructor. The more segment you have, the smoother your shape will be. And here are other types of geometry. So that should give you some ideas of the geometry in 3JS. In the next video, I'm going to show you how to import the 3D models from Blender into 3JS and display it on web page. So don't forget to subscribe to our channel to stay tuned and if you like this video, hit the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video. Bye.